if, if we hadn't had that vaccine roll out now, mm. we would still be walking around here with daft masks on doing all that malarkey, wouldn't we? This might be considered a party now. I, I don't well, I don't. on the table. Well, I'm not Prime Minister. I'm not making the rules. Partygate's not gone away, has it? It hasn't. It hasn't. And you know what? I, 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 I shared the experience of having somebody who we lost, couldn't visit them in hospital, couldn't attend a funeral, and I, and I understand the anger of people on that front. Um, you know, it's there. I've made, I've made my sounds to government about that issue. Um, at the same time, I was out there at the weekend for all the anger that some people have about it. Mm. The other people are angry about the fact that we spend most time on a television show like this or reading through the newspaper mm. talking about this thing when we've got issues in Russia and Ukraine, we've got issues with the cost of living, we've got issues... You know, they want to get on with... But, there's an issue, the big but there is an issue of trust. And Boris has been... Ah, his relationship with the truth is a very interesting debate, isn't it? Um, he, he has said things again and again and again that have proved to be wholly wrong. And I think what he's lost, and he'll have, have lost it with some of your constituents, is trust. And when you've lost trust, winning it back is hard. I mean, do you think he's going to stay? I think, do you know what I want to do? I, I, I think trial by media is a really bad thing. I'm angry about some of the things that have come out. But at the same time, I think it's right that we see what the Sue Gray report says in full. We see what the police say about it. Because actually, was it last weekend the media were having a debate as to whether there was or there wasn't a cake? Trial by media is a really bad thing. We see some... One thing I've learnt from this job mm. is never believe all of the things you read on social media or in a newspaper. Crikey, have you seen the stuff that gets printed in the mirror? You know... Let's oh, have, I've seen loads of it over the years. Let's see what the police say. Let's see what Sue Gray so says. They make informed opinions it, about these things. And this could drag on for God knows how long. I, I, I agree. We want it moving. We want it moving now. We want to see that Sue Gray report in full and we want the police to investigate quickly. It's agony. It is agony. I mean, it's not good, is it? It's not good. And it hangs over government. It distracts and I do everybody. Accept, I do accept your point that, you know, as this pandemic bore down upon us, I mean, this was a very difficult thing for government to deal with. And I get that. I understand that. But despite all of that, you know, there's a feeling that promises haven't been kept. Well, uh, well the big promise is levelling up, isn't it? It's delivering Brexit and levelling up.